you know ain't nothing changed one bit. It's a unique hustle. Check it, check it, check it. It's a unique hustle. It's your boy ECO. And I'm here with the lovely, amazing, official Miss Jamaica. What's going on? Not 90 number day. Man, we in the building, man. We back, man. We on the set, baby. We got a guy in here. He don't need no introduction, man, because he calls a lot of ruckus, man. That's old school slang right there. A lot of ruckus. Media conglomerate. The boy is from a land called the Arklatex. This boy right here, man, you never know what he gonna say when he get on this platform. We've been, this is gonna be probably our third interview with this dude. Probably six. This man right here done been on here as a co-host. Uh, uh, he was a guest co-host. This guy right here, uh, he done had all kind of issues with different people who came up against his uh, 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 region. 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 Uh, this boy right here, man. Uh Okay. It's going down, man. Really, man. This guy here, yeah. I'm going to go right back into it. Oh, yeah. One of the coldest dudes you ever want to deal with when it comes to that internet, man. You don't want to, you want to be on his team. You do not want to be on the opposite team, man. Check it, man. That boy Trill Talk, no Peel Talk is in the building. Yes, media conglomerate. Trill man. Talk, no peel talk. Media conglomerate. Yeah. Man, so what's going on, Trill Talk, no Peel Talk? Chilling, man. You know, being injured for a while. Man, you know what? Congratulations on your page, man. Yeah, man, we at 37K right now. Mm -hmm. Over 11 million views. Um, man, so man, you one of those guys, man, that you know, you don't need no introduction with everything you've been doing. Boy, you something else, man. I'm not even gonna play with you, bro. You, you, um, you, you one of those guys I look at, man. I get a lot of my information from you. I first of all want to tell you thank you for all the time right. when I hit you up and be like, man, what, what you think I need to ask this nigga? What you think I need to ask that nigga? Cause me and you, we go so far back as to, you remember, uh, Miss Jamaica when, when he had, uh, uh, said he had, at the time, I think he had about 400, 300, 300 yeah. and we had five or 600. Mm -hmm. and, and, and now you at 80-something, 80, 88. 88,000, man. About to be, man, yeah. these boys, hey, they didn't see this one coming. It was, mm -hmm. it, it, this one here, this one, this one here was seriously something I don't think nobody would have been able to just look at and say, this is what these guys going to do. I think they... I think they was watching, but I didn't think they understood the algorithm that we was about they to take them down. Game. They thought it was a game. I, I just respect everybody that's in this world after I've been in it long, like, you know, over a year. I, I, I respect these guys because I know these guys, man, are giving it they all to keep these platforms up and running. Oh, yeah. Man, so, man, you 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 you, you chilling, man. Now, now, when I called you, it was something about your arm stopped working for you. It didn't just yeah, stop. Didn't stop. You had a little slight, you know, <laughs> I'm falling and I can't get up. Yeah, man, I broke my arm. What the hell was you, man, what kind of dude be breaking his arm? You over 40, ain't you? Yeah, man, I was, um, it's crazy because I was bowling. You bowl like that? Yeah, you know, I'm, I'm partly, a, you know, a professional bowler, you know, kind of a professional bowler. You slide your feet back whenever you kick it? No, nah, actually, um, it was a, you know, um, it was a little uh, defect in the, in one of the shoes, but uh, you know, can't talk about a lot of it right now, you know. Yeah, yeah. Well, it's gonna definitely be a, a, a hell of a ride. You ready to take that ride? I'm pretty sure. Oh man. yeah, man. I just hate. I just hate it happen. Really, you know what I mean? Oh yeah, it's all good, man. I'm, I'm good now. Well, I ain't good, but I'm good. You know. You getting better? Yeah, I'm getting better. Cause I, you know, I ain't trying to be funny, but you know, you you a real fighter, so I know already how that affects oh, yeah, you. Man, I'm strong, man. I'm strong. A real fighter, like Mendingo Warrior type dude. <laughs> and that slow down business a lot for you. Uh, kind of, sort of. Yes and no, I say yes and no. Uh, so they got to give you uh, money back up, for that, too. Yeah, yeah, it messed me up far as um, going like, uh, like being able to do interviews and stuff. Right. Like I wasn't able to travel and go do stuff because I couldn't drive and like that. But you wasn't able to, for the first some, how many um, weeks, you still wasn't able to post as much as you used to because yeah. your arm were hurting. Yeah, and I was out, but shoot, you know, I, I make it work. You know, I got a little system. I got a little system that I work, you know, where I still stay relevant. Mm -hmm. Broke a couple stories here and there in the middle of it. Mm -hmm. What's the biggest story you broke during that time? Uh, Probably be a uh, finesse two times in chief. Mm. That'd probably be one of the biggest ones. What's the backlash on that? Uh, but hold on, you said that was the biggest one, but wasn't the um, uh, zero, zero and trade, yeah, and zero trade, trade during yeah, that yeah. time too? Yeah, yeah, I forgot about and that. And you were one of the first ones to break that one, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I saw in comments people were saying congratulations on being the first one to break it and such and such mm -hmm. and such, but yeah. you got backlash from that too. Oh yeah, I got backlash. You? Well, really not no backlash, like uh, 
because I ain't record the video. Somebody else record the video, and like I get messages like. A lot of the posts like that, like breaking news, it come from like fans. Mm -hmm. They send them to me. Uh, they'll say I open my inbox and I look in there and I had like three all these videos. I had a video I clicked on and I, when I clicked on it, the fight came up. I was like, golly. But when you get stuff like that, because you're a blogger and stuff like yeah. that, and you get um, fans sending you information to post, do you actually do research on it first oh, before yeah, yeah, you yeah, post yeah, it? Yeah, 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 most definitely, most definitely. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm make sure it's, it ain't false news for one. Right. Yeah. So that you make sure that any backlash should come with it, you can stand your ground and be like, well. Yeah, yeah, well, this is where I got it from. Yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Do you also check into your sources? I mean, like, do you, because you, get videos, so you yeah. get videos all the time. Yeah. So you pick and choose which ones to put up? Yeah, yeah, like some of them I ain't going to, certain stuff I ain't going to post. Depends on who it's from. Yeah, yeah. Like certain people, though, I'm not going to post them. I don't care how viral it can go. If it's certain stuff, I ain't going to post it. I want to yeah. jump to something real quick because I saw this on um, online the other day on your story, actually, because I don't know if you put it on a post, but I know yeah. you have it on a story yeah. to say that if any artists have any guns in their oh, yeah, I'm with the guns. Yeah, in I'm their like, videos or posts or anything, because I know that people contact you and pay you to post their yeah. content. So why is that? So why has the um, Instagram or anybody like flagged you for it or cost you money for yeah, it? Exactly. Right now, my page, uh, I can't. I ain't monetized on uh, Instagram until I think January. Because of that? Yeah, because of the guns and stuff like that in the video. Oh. Yeah, and it was like, it wasn't no one video. It was like probably about, I'm going to say probably close to 20 videos. But how many times have you gotten warned about it before I they actually? I ain't never warned. This was crazy. It like all happened all of a sudden. And you didn't get warned about it? Nothing. But I thought they supposed to at least warn you before they just take yeah, it, all think, that. Nigga, they, they, they warn you. I think they warn before they nigga, take they the Nigga, they done sent that thing. You right. just didn't realize it, nigga. Hey, you man, already know they warned you. I'm going to tell you something. They send out little letters all the time to y'all emails, and y'all do not read them. And I know you don't, because I don't, nigga. Yeah. So I'm telling you right now, they warned you. They warned you, and you didn't take heed to it, and now you living the, uh, you reaping the benefits of it. Yeah. yeah Am I, I mean, right? Nah, they didn't, they, didn't, they didn't warn me. They they really never have warned me. I'm telling you, I ain't you never ain't read it on Facebook. I didn't got I didn't got warnings on same on them. But see on Instagram, I ain't never got no warning. Same on them, my nigga. Stop playing. Same on them. You already know that too. Yeah, Mark Zuckerberg. Oh, but see, I think they give a warning when they finna take your page though. I don't think so. They I just think. took my money away. Like I can't make no money from uh, Instagram right now. You can't make no money from Instagram. Nah. But you make money from it, nigga. You know already I know the deal. Don't play me, nigga. Yeah, you yeah, charge yeah, people. Money. Yeah, yeah, you yeah, doing all kind like of that, stuff, that nigga. Way, yeah, Don't yeah. play me. Yeah, most definitely. So you already know I ain't no fool. I'm going to figure it out. Oh, yeah. You a money man. You like to get that bread, nigga. Most definitely. So then, you're, you're talking about you a money man, but next year, if somebody want to send you a video and has guns in there, but they're spend it, they giving you a thousand, two thousand dollars to long bar. I play for the long bar. I, I ain't worrying about that short time money. Okay. I can I can I can cancel I can tell them no and still I'll still get that money. Okay, just check in yeah. to see if there's a price on it. Yeah, but them guns anyway, it ain't no good deal anyway, man. I'm tired of seeing them guns. Everybody rapping about sticks and dicks. That's it. Just sticks and dicks. That's it. You know what I'm saying? That's a, it's what it's about, man. Like all these rappers' videos, they be be a bunch of niggas in the video, man. So you're talking about that, but where do you think this music industry is going? Because they've been doing that for the longest now. Yeah, but it, it's it's the, the the rappers change. You know, it's they uh pretty much it's the rappers' choice. They the ones making it like that, like to keep making that type of music. Uh huh. Yeah, because I mean, it's but, no, you say it's the rappers' choice in making these type of music, but it's the people who listen to it. If people not listening to it, they gonna switch it and start rapping against something else. Yeah, but the rapper control the narrative by what he rapping about. Huh? The rapper changed the narrative. So if if the um, the consumer is not listening to this type of music, then the rappers are gonna have to stop rapping man, about all this stuff. Man, but they gonna listen to that. They gonna listen to whatever the rappers put out if it's good. Yeah, but you just said you tired of hearing it. So yeah, I know man. a lot of people out there is tired of hearing it, and not just you. But that's the rappers' fault though, because the rappers they ain't got no uh, how you say that uh, no originality. Like you got to think outside the box. You can't rap about the same stuff all the time. Mm -hmm. Like I don't listen to rappers who rap about the same stuff all the time. But it's every it's everything that we do in society right now because I was watching a post about um, and this has something totally different from um, rapping, but where females are concerned, we're looking at like decor decorating and everybody who decorates their house is decorating it in the same 
same way that contemporary look yeah. just like rapping everybody's rapping the same way because that's what everybody's gravitating to that's what everybody's mm -hmm. loving this that's the trend right now mm -hmm. once people start getting tired of that and drifting to another trend that everybody's gonna start drifting from that to changing their style to something yeah, but else who, but who changes it though the rappers change most of the time yeah, the, the, but, the it, creator, but it takes, creator, but it takes, a, it takes change. a group of rappers. It takes, it or takes it a take train one, to start. Or it takes one. Yeah, it takes one to start. Yeah, yeah, one, yeah. But it takes years for others to start to catch on because I guarantee you, right now there's some rapper out there who already started doing something different, but everybody else looking at them like you wag, like why are you rapping about that? That's this, 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 mm. this. But then that's the same reason why years down the line people look back at that same rapper and talk about you ahead of the game. You were ahead yeah, yeah, of the game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Most because yeah, that, you had it all the time. You yeah, understand you what it. I mean? Oh, yeah, you so had it all the time. it's just that people be hating on that person right now and there's somebody out there doing that because yeah. they want to change it. You just got to respect people in their lane, man, and let them do what they do in their lane. That's yeah, true. Yeah, that's the thing. So what makes you different from every other blogger? Because I'm trivial. <laughs> <laughs> no, but, but seriously. But, but from because, every other blogger, because I'm, yeah. I'm from East Texas. Cause I mean, uh, name another blog in East Texas. Um, got one. Takeover TV. Takeover TV. That's it. That's it. I'm different. What makes you different from Takeover? Um, because Takeover, uh, he kind of do like uh, Takeover do a lot of interviewing business people. Mm -hmm. Like he, he kind of like uh, I would say like he. Um, but you saying just because you're East Texas, but I don't want to just put you in East Texas like no, 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 because right. the yeah, way yeah. how you be pushing it, the way how you are, I'm not just going to categorize you to East Texas. I want to categorize you. What is the difference between you and every other blogger out there that you see hot right now on social media? I'm not even talking just Texas, because you uh, see them, you see them post consistency and authenticity. Uh, Cause I ain't uh, like I ain't bought no followers, I ain't bought none of that. Like I know a lot of people be they buy for, they boost their pages up all that. That's cool, no, but I just don't do that. Cause that's the whole thing. That's my uh, that's really like what my page is built off off the trail. That's where the trail talk come from. Are you the only blogger that don't do that? Everybody else buy views and buy stuff. No, it's some other ones that don't do it, but it's a, it's a, it's the majority. It's a bunch of them that do though. It's a bunch of them that do. Okay. Yeah. I'm what? talking about like big names and everything. It's a bunch of them that do. You want to call any names? No, nah, nah, I ain't. <laughs> <laughs> Let me ask you a question, man. Mm -hmm. uh, I seen this morning that Charleston White and uh, Rainwater was uh, going back and forth, uh, like they, uh, I, I think they having issues or something. Um, how much of this stuff can we believe on the internet? Do you believe what's going on with them? Man, I don't believe nothing until I, I gotta see it. I gotta, I gotta see it. It in just real happened time. today, nigga. Yeah, I gotta see it in real time. All I'm telling you is, it, it, it's, it, it's a lot of back and forth. You just seen Ti and uh, Charleston go back and forth. Yeah. Um, I, I, I seen all this happen on the internet. Now we see Rainwater and uh, Charleston going back and forth. We seen Ti go at Boosie's kid. Vlad had asked about uh, Vlad had asked uh, Boosie about that as well. Yeah, and he told you, him, and, and he told him he don't speak on him. Yeah. Uh, you, who else? And then you seen Charleston go at the at the kids. Yeah. Uh, when you look at stuff like this and you start to uh, see the whole situation of what's evolving and revolving and evolution happening, where do you what do you what do you think about it as a guy who always posting and trying to figure out if something's real or not? Trio talk, no peel talk. Mm -hmm. On a situation like that, man, like me personally, I believe like man, when you in this entertainment business, you free game. Like you know what I'm saying? Like you can't say don't talk about nobody's kids, cause at the end of the day, every person you talk about is somebody's child. You somebody's child. I'm somebody's child. At the end of the day, everybody's somebody's kid. You see what I'm saying? Nah, I so I mean, it. like the kid got on the internet. See, first of all, my How kids. How old is Ken? Oh, he like 18, 19, but me personally, my, my kids ain't finna get on the internet and do none of that. Like, that, that's gonna be nipped in the bud off top. I ain't no kid, my kids ain't finna get on there. I don't care who coming in me or whatever, my kids ain't gonna get involved in it at all. Well, he came at the kids first. Right. And then the father, being yeah, the father, the stepped first. in, and that's when he stepped in and said what he said. Uh, I think King said something first when he was on -uh. there, Charleston White, you a bitch. No, you know no, no, no. I mean, I don't know what came first, but I'm just saying, though, he, the kids shouldn't have said it in the first place. Well, if. If he says something about even, it, if, even what if he is says a kid? Somebody. Is this man twenty years old, twenty one? Eighteen. He went to jail the other day, so he, he yeah, eighteen he plus. Gone, yeah. He can get life in prison right now. So he Shit. can he can say what he want to yeah, say. Yeah, but my kids ain't gonna do that, man. You gotta check your kids. Oh, I'm checking my kids, but I already yeah. know if if it's something. You no, know, me, I ain't gonna respond on the internet about nothing like that. No way, though, really. No, that's the best way yeah, to be. Yeah, I'm gonna ignore it. I, but do you? 
do you have a fear for anything when it come down to this internet cause niggas be spitting this or talking that or saying this or is it fake or is it real? Like, do I have a fear of what? Do you think that some of this could get somebody really physically harmed? Or do you? Uh, yeah, most definitely, most definitely. Hell yeah, hell yeah, it can. You know, if it ain't did right, I guess. You know what I'm saying? But that's the internet games, man. That's what I'm saying. It's just internet games. I don't, I don't play them like that, man. Well, I mean, you know, because I seen you jump on a, a few times and say things, and I had to call you and calm you down. Ah, but I, mean, yeah, I seen I, you, I jump, say I seen you jump on there if and I say, say a few things when the nigga came at East Texas, like you were rah rah. Oh, yeah, you goddamn right. You <laughs> goddamn right. Yeah, if it's if it's somebody talking about East Texas, oh yeah, most definitely. Most so definitely. you jumped on there and rah rah rah. Yeah, yeah, but I ain't jump on there and go back and forth. I nah, said you what said I said. What and you I got said. Out. Yeah, that's it. And it went crazy. All the bloggers start posting it like Trill Talk won't smoke with whoever trying to get ten rappers and all yeah. that this this trio talk and to I niggas. still stand on it well we can't say that 10 rappers in East Texas I ain't heard nothing I ain't heard nothing really lately at all really 19 rappers in Dallas I ain't heard nothing right now nigga please they man, kill my boy man you got one rapper that's hot in Dallas right who? now who what Big X so I ain't, I ain't nobody hotter than Big X ain't nobody hotter than Big X and who pushing, in, who pushing in East Texas right now cause we haven't really heard nobody we got Smooth we got Rose Summer yeah, but we can I'm say saying, that. We got, we, got, we got all kind of people. We got CKP. I mean, hey, we got platinum hear, artists now. Okay, but we you got hear all kind of people in Houston. We got all kind of people in Dallas. Name, we got name, all kind name, of people name, in name, East Texas. Name your top five you in Houston. Tripping. Name your top five in Houston right now. Man, it's a bunch of them. Name them, though. Bro, they, name. all these little Yo, niggas I do name, rap. Man. They name, name, man. All they do, every nigga want to be a rapper. They might not be a good yeah. one, but all these niggas rapping. Man, you so we got part-time rappers and you got real rappers. You know, you got some part-time rappers and I don't entertain part-time rappers. I really just don't be watching them young niggas like that, but I really know these niggas rapping because they called in my inbox I go in my inbox man, right now and telling, give you about 30 to 40 nigga I'm telling you I still stand on what I said you can't name me name me five hot rappers in Houston and five hot rappers it's called no who's scaling the hot nigga hell is you if saying you say that, if you say so hot has to do with consistency a lot of time too I don't mean somebody to coming up right now yeah. and then the, you, they die off yeah, yeah I mean you gotta be consistently putting out music oh yeah most who definitely. is consistently putting out music in East Texas everybody name. Rosama consistent, Smoothie consistent. Rosama by Rosama and J1K yeah. consistent. The whole AJ family consistent. AJ1K is not from no East they, Texas, they nigga. And you said that. No, 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 no. I, didn't, I didn't do my research for it. Oh, you took it back. He okay. From, he from East Texas, but he from he from Mississippi too. But he from East Texas too. That's like you can be you can move somewhere. When you a kid, you can live somewhere. Then you move somewhere. Where you where you where you was at when you got your stripes? That's where you from. And he been here long enough. He East Texas. It's called know what rep, you. It's and called East Texas. It called know what you call in stripes too, nigga. I mean, shit, call it what you want. I done got stripes in Dallas. I ain't got stripes oh, in East man, Texas, Houston, man, everywhere, no, nigga. No, so what man, is you talking about? Man, well, what is hey, you saying? Where, where you rep? Where you represent? I'm all Earth is my turf, nigga. Hell is wrong with you? I can't everywhere tell. Everywhere I everywhere I lay my hat, nigga, is my home. You so nigga. looking real Dallas ish. No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you so looking real Dallas. I have to be the I have to be the devil's advocate with you because you so East Texas. Yeah, ain't you was that way. you was tripping. Jersey. He was look at the Jersey, nigga. That's you Trent was, Williams. You was tripping off of East me Texas, big when I said, man, look, man, we got to do everybody. No, nah, nigga, we got we got to do East Texas. I, yeah, I had to real, get yeah. you out of that, nigga. Nah. Like we got to get the world to see what we doing. You yeah. were so caught up. Up to where I didn't think you would never go interview nobody else but East Texas nigga. Yeah, they gotta be worth my time. <laughs> but I like that about you though, because I love where I'm from. Oh, but yeah. at the end of the day, I just feel like there's so much help in the world. We gotta help everybody, man. We can't just help East Texas. East Texas is is is, is a portion of our, our situation. Yeah, but you know, I mean, at, at some Here point go. you gotta stand for you, where you're from. You know what I'm saying? I and I stand on that. I still, you know what I'm saying? And we got so many female rappers in East Texas. Man, you keep on throwing all these. Nuts. You do this every time I mean, you come on my show. Really, it's you this truth. show, this really your third show. I had to not who put out. Gonna, who I didn't put out it? one of your interviews because you went too far. Now just think hey, about what you're doing. Yeah, yeah, because if you go saying. too far, I can't put it out. But nigga. I'm just saying, man, we got, we got, we got. I'm telling you, we got some steppers in East Texas. Well, you know, and and I think there's steppers in Dallas and steppers oh, yeah, in yeah, yeah, Houston, yeah, yeah, and I just feel like uh, if you don't be careful, you know, you you mess around there and say something, you might not be able to stand behind nigga. Who me? Oh, I can stand on anything. That's one thing. But I'm stand on anything. <laughs> so let me let me just let me let me uh, let, let me dive in a little deeper, man. Uh, so, I mean, do you buy fake fake views for Hell real? No. No hell niggas nah. is hell no. Nah. Oh, that shit real. <laughs> Ain't none of that shit fake. Hell no. Nah. You 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 can prove that? Yeah, I can prove that. 
I mean, because I seen some, a list that you put out one day talking about all the people numbers. Yeah. What gives you the audacity to take every blogger number, including mine? I got a bone to pick with you too, nigga. You put me number two on your little list, nigga. Hey, I'm really sick of nigga put me on. I mean, don't put me on no more of them lists, nigga. Hey, I'm just saying. Don't you put you me on no more of them lists. Hey, man, you was number two, man. Hey, man. You, you, see, you working, though. You working, nigga, though. Nigga, ain't nobody harder than <laughs> me, nigga. <laughs> Hell is wrong you with working you. Though. You working though. You gonna get there, man. Bro, I'm not. I'm, be I don't go by what you say. You anyway, be one one day. You know I done traveled and did all this with these cameras, and you gonna give me number two, my nigga. Yeah, man, I had to give you number two, man. You tripping? Yeah, I had to. Give Ain't you no two. nigga come out in a one year and did what I did and scale and do the numbers I did. Ain't do nobody did what I did in one year. That ain't got nothing to do with me. I'm talking about the way you made this list. I'm putting me hey, on I'm there. I'm saying, hey man, hey. You acting like one. You acting real hard. Acting just like the yeah, You acting like a rapper right now. <laughs> That's exactly be like, doing yeah. that. I yeah, see you. like a rapper. For real. No, I just thank you for even thinking about me to put me oh, on yeah. the list, man. Thank oh, yeah, you so much for that. Oh, yeah. Cause that's real, man. Like I said, you didn't have to do that. And and at the end of the day, I don't know who working with you, but I talked to Terry Blue about the list you and him had did together. Yeah. And he had a little, you know, ah, East Texas don't really, you know, it didn't do nothing for me. The list didn't do nothing for me. I said, but nigga, be careful with. See, I flip it on so down on another come, nigga. If another gotta, nigga come in, I flip. Nigga, I allowed to go crazy any way I want to in here. So I'm just saying, when y'all did that list together, did you did you think it would do traction for for Terry Blue? I mean, shoot. I mean, he gotta he gotta make some traction in East Texas. He gotta start fucking with the artists in East Texas. I get it. I get it. Yeah, like that you sense. gotta like you gotta make them the artists gonna make the people drive to your page. Like I didn't gain I gained fans from posting just like they gained fans from posting on my page. I gained fans from posting them. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it worked it worked both ways. I, I like the way you 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 working though. I love your consistent grind. That's oh, the yeah. most important thing oh, yeah. is to stay consistent, man. Um, where do you see yourself uh, by the end of this year? What what number are you trying to reach on Instagram? What number are you trying to reach on uh, YouTube? And what number are you trying to reach YouTube. on? You on TikTok, nigga? Nah, yeah, I'm on there, but I ain't on there. Own, you go, you want to go viral? Find that tape where you fell at that damn uh, bowling alley <laughs> and just put that hoe out on TikTok. Nah. Falling and getting up, falling and getting up, falling and getting up, and you going to go viral, Hell nigga. Nah, Trill man. talk, no pill talk. Yeah, I ain't finna do that, man. Oh, well. See, man, do you, 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 I want some money. I don't want the fame. Give me some money. Give me some money. So, where do you see yourself? Uh, I'm going to say bottom bottom. Because you did this before. I told me, uh, I'm going to say probably... On YouTube, I'm gonna say I'm gonna just do YouTube. I'm gonna say uh, probably uh, I'm at 37. I'll probably be at 50k by the end of the year. 50k? Yeah, by January I'll be at 50k. <sighs> I'm at 37k I, I, right now. I'm gonna hit 100k for the end of this year. Yeah, I believe. I ain't playing no game yeah, with these niggas. I believe. And I just started, nigga, and I'm real good at it too, nigga. And I'm, right. I'm not no you number two, right. nigga. You know, you right. no, I'm not no number two. You all right? But you I'm gonna, I'm not gonna let it go. <laughs> Yeah, you all right. You know what I'm saying? You all right. No, but I, I definitely, uh, I, it's, it's the consistent work, and I thank God for all the people that have been uh, really uh, blessing the platform and showing love and respect to what we got going over at Boss Talk 101 with Miss Jamaica and Money Moses, wherever he may be, and that new Brittany Loso. Brittany Loso is a new addition. You're going to meet yeah, her yeah, today. See, yeah, what do you think that. about her? Yeah, that was cool. Well, I like the show you did. Uh, what was it? Uh, broke she didn't did about three, four more. What I just was it rich people problem? She's yeah, doing that rich people, people problem. problem. Yeah, I checked it out. She, you know, she did the Boosie gone uh, yeah, bad, gone, wild. Yeah, gone, gone bad. Gone yeah. bad. Yeah. She did that, and then I told her that day when I interviewed, her, I say, I want to bring you back on because you, you know, you sound like you a radio host, nigga, but you ain't yeah. got no accolades, nigga. Oh, yeah. I need that right here. Oh, what you gonna get the accolades yeah. for? Oh, but I just want to work with her. When she take off, I can say I had my hand. I'm gonna be like yeah. Gucci Man back in the day. <laughs> 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 what do you think is the biggest story that you've uh, you've covered uh, in tw so far in 2022? 2022. Uh, um, I'd probably say that zero and Trey shit. Yeah, zero and Trey you think shit so? Pretty big. That or that finesse and uh, either that or finesse and uh, and Chief. That'll probably be the biggest. biggest finesse story and Chief. This year. Yeah. Finesse and Chief was big. Yeah, it was big, but that zero and Trey shit was big. You know, you know when I came out the gate that first year, when that Charleston White ran out of here on the yeah. OG, that was the biggest thing hit the internet. Oh, yeah. Niggas didn't give mm -hmm. my credit, nigga. But I hit this whole like a like a nigga. They ain't never seen no nigga set no four, three, four niggas up in here. You gotta, you everybody ain't doing that. You should let them fight though. Charleston left too fast. Oh, you should let him. He was fight. moving. He hit the door moving, and I couldn't. Hey, 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 you know. <laughs> 
<laughs> but but and I called you and told you it's going down, nigga. Yeah, you you called me right when it happened. Yeah, so you know, I, I don't know, man. Like I said, I really think that you I think I, I think you're right. I think the the, the I think it was the Trey and Zero thing. Yeah. I ain't, was, like that was though, I ain't like that was big. That was big. I ain't like that though, man. You mad about it? No, nah, I just don't like to see no Texas legends. I don't either. Head, like going back and forth with each other. Like that's why I took the video down. You took it down? Yeah, yeah. they asked me. You to take put it, it down. up first. Yeah, they asked me to. Well, you, you nah, actually somebody, called me, didn't you? Somebody had sent it. Somebody like a person had posted it, and they sent it to me, and I copied it from their page and posted it. But you got traction, so yours yeah, made yeah, the most yeah. impact. And I deleted it. You know what I'm saying? Because I was like, man, I don't, I don't even. I'm saying I, I don't want nobody recording me. If somebody if somebody whooping me and, and I'm getting recorded, I'm telling you I'm I'm like Charleston. I'm gonna get up. I'm, they gonna the person with the camera gonna get hurt. Okay. Yeah. Don't record me. But you gonna have about five six people recording. You can't beat all of them. Yeah, In today's you. industry, everybody gonna have their camera out recording. Yeah, it's gonna it's gonna. I promise you. I ain't put me on say cheese or or, or whatever you want to say world star. I ain't, I ain't going for that shit. Hell no. Nah. A boss talk, nigga. Yeah. Smile talk, yeah. <laughs> you bastard. <laughs> yeah. man. So that's another channel. That can't oh, be but me. you didn't make it to my movie premiere either, man. You know what? The reason I didn't, what had happened was, tell him, baby, go on tell the nigga yeah. what happened. We had interviews. We had interviews, nigga. You supposed we to cancel that. Cancel it? Yeah, you supposed to cancel that for me. I'm not with that cancel culture stuff. So. For that me, what? for me. That's <laughs> East Texas, that's how I know you ain't really East Texas. Like but you, say, you know man. what he told me, though? Hold on. We had that, and I told him to cancel. Mm. But he said that you said it was already sold out, so we wouldn't have oh, been yeah, able yeah, to get it. Boom. But if you would have got your ticket when I first sent it to you, you wouldn't have to worry about it being sold out. Yeah, but I should have been able to get in anyway, nigga. I'm but anyway, it's another screening for uh, parole money too. Uh, <laughs> October thirtieth. That's uh, next Sunday for y'all that don't know. You know, uh, y'all can go check it out at Studio Movie Grill in Tyler, Texas. Parole money too, right there. Yeah, had to plug that in too. <laughs> so another screening. Yeah, they're going to show it again. Uh, it'll be, um, like I said, on October the 30th. They're going to show it again. They're going to have another red carpet. Again. So once they do that, where, what channels is going to be uh, It'll out? be on Prime, Tubi, all of that. When? Uh, I, I really can't tell you today because, you know, like I ain't the one that made the movie. Like Michael Baker, that's who made the movie. You know what I'm saying? I'm just in the movie. And if you had to rate the movie from a 1 to 10? On hood movies, I'd say it's probably about a, a 1 to 10. I'm going to say about an 8 or 9. About an 8 or 9. Yeah. Why not a 10? What was uh, wrong? Because we just getting started. You got to get yourself room to grow. Mm. Yeah. But you saw errors, right? Yeah, yeah, I saw some errors, but we that's that's the thing. That's what's going to make Parole Money 3 better. Oh, okay. Yeah. What's up with these artists, uh, especially a lot of East Texas artists, saying that they working behind the scene, I mean, you know, and doing stuff? Uh man, that behind the scene should be capped sometimes. That's what I think. I think it's capped. I think a lot of this capped. Man, we need to see what you're doing. Like, you got to have something going on on the internet. Name a quiet rapper who's successful. This just quiet. Did I'm talking about on the come up, not no, not no person that blew. Yeah, that's like, why I didn't say that. Yeah, on the come up, you gotta be, you gotta be loud. Yeah, yeah, you right about that. Yeah, you gotta be loud. Like you can still do your stuff behind the scenes, and you know what I'm saying, make your shit shake, but you still gotta be putting something out there. You gotta have some content. Hmm. So what? What do you think outside of the one I just named? What was the which one of our, our interviews did you like the best this year? Uh, oh, yeah, I was, uh, I'm gonna say uh, this year. This year, yeah. Uh, you know, I'm gonna say Bubba Dub. That's my nigga. He I'm called me Bubba yesterday. Dub. You gave him my number. I guess yeah. he lost my damn number. Yeah, yeah you he, ain't important. You being biased? You, you just say Bubba Dub because y'all best nigga, friends. That that's about it. Shout out to Bubba Dub. Just because y'all best friends, the way you talking about Bubba Dub on there was the best. That's the only reason why. Hey, man, I mean, it is what it is. Man. That went hard, yeah. yeah I told him it was going to go hard. We said it. We, I slapped yeah. him in the hand when yeah. he left. I said, nigga, that's the one right here. Okay, if this was if that was the best one, what part of that Get interview him. was the best? When he cracked a, a joke at me. By my own. Best part. That nigga did say that. Me, yeah. yeah, he did talk about yeah, you on see, here. Hey. <laughs> and you didn't even clip it, though. <laughs> nigga, you so famous, you don't even clip the video. No, Man. When I first came out, you would clip anything. Now that you done got all these secretary followers to do viewers. I be having to get my secretary to do some of this stuff, man, you know. That nigga don't even clip nothing no more, nigga. He's like, yeah, I'll get to it if I get to oh, it. Oh, man, go yeah, on, man. Man. I just clipped you not too long ago, I, man. You when? Um, I clipped you when, um, I don't think I clipped you. I clipped, uh, Dizzy Banks talking about you. That nigga did say something yeah. about Boss mm -hmm. Talk, didn't he? he said he's What's up with these talk? niggas that's coming out? That, like, shout out to Dizzy Banks. Shout out to Beehive for saying they, they watching Boss Talk. Yeah. But what I really want to say is, man, Jeezy has got a new song that just Scarface. hit. Yeah. And he got that Boss Talk mm -hmm. talk going on there because, nigga, 
Yeah. <laughs> Boy, I said, Mom, I made it. <laughs> these niggas is really liking the show. Yeah, and I, and because when we first drug these tables up in here, you know, and I've been here 16 years, I knew already, you know, me and you, I'm a country nigga, man. Yeah. So I know these niggas gonna have to feel us because at the end of the day, it's gonna be raw. Oh, yeah. And it's gonna be street. Yeah. And it's gonna be something, they got, like, damn, why that nigga do that nigga crazy? You know how I many niggas from B King, all these niggas come in here and they be like, yeah, nigga, we watching and nigga, it's yeah. ready. Like we like it because you got a TV say it's gutter, man. That's what oh, yeah. he like about. It. He say he ain't going no other show. What he say you gonna be big? He, that's what he told me. <laughs> 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 and he, and we went down there. You ain't seen none of that footage yet. I just got it back and it's very skip, it's skippish, but yeah. it's coming out. I got all them. I did Lil Rock. I mean, name like when we came out. Look how we hit we hit Lil Rock. Vegas, we hit New Orleans. LA. We hit Vegas three times. We hit LA, LA three times. Chicago. Uh, we hit uh, uh, where else, Bay? Atlanta, Atlanta oh, three yeah. times. Y'all didn't go to South Carolina or something. Like we didn't go. We stopped go. Yeah, on the way because yeah. the rain. We got rained out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But you ain't seen nobody really come in though like that, man. Yeah. It ain't. And then setting the whole setup up. That was the whole game for me. We put the work in uh, because we love the people. Yeah. And it's it's growing. Like I was at the place this morning. I was tell, I don't I don't even think I told her. Nigga come out and say, What you doing here? I was the, the, I, I went and rented an excavator this morning with some Mexican dudes as partners of mine. Yeah. And I paid boom, I went to yeah, pay for yeah. it. Big money, yeah. And when I went to pay for it, hold on. <laughs> when I went to pay for it, nigga come out the back and say, Nick, what is you doing here? Like I don't pose a come out. Yeah. I promise. What's the craziest thing that happened to you when you be out and somebody be like, That's trill talk, no peel talk. Rapper beating on his chest, rapping to me. Who was, who was I that? I don't know him. I asked him, did he want me to post him? He said, no, nah, I need some studio time. I'm like, some studio time? What you need some studio time for? Like, right, you get your own studio time? Like, you want me to, you want to post? Because I was going to post him. If he said, if he said, yeah, I want to record. He just wanted you to see him rapping. Yeah, I guess so. Yeah. That's live. He didn't yeah. feel like he was ready yet. That's the problem. Because if respect, you ready. Respect, yeah. Because if you ready, you're going to say, yeah, I want you to I'm post tell you, me. Now that would be me, I'd have been like, yeah, post that post shit. That, post yeah, that, yeah, get that, get that whole Ready or not. Yeah, I would have seen you post that shit. Yeah. yeah. Man, that's heavy, man. So, I mean, just, uh, I ain't going to, because we got, we going to have, we got a lot of interviews today to do. Yeah. You got to be interview, viewing yeah. people with me today. Yeah. Uh, we got a lot of people from East Texas that's going to be on this platform today. Yeah, big East Texas you, stuff, yeah. Hey, listen, man, yeah, you yeah. got to, you got to, you, you know what we doing. Yeah. You know, if you get on here with that mess today, though, <laughs> I'm telling you right now, I'm coming with it. So don't be playing, nigga, when these niggas get yeah. up here. Yeah, I heard All right? You. And, uh, we asking hard questions. Yeah. I hard love, questions. I love the hard questions. Yeah. <laughs> hard questions, yeah, man. I love them. So, um, babe, what, what do you think about it? You think he ready? You think we ready to get on to the next episode? Yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Ooh, ooh, nigga, it's serious when she say that. I'm finna yeah. go in on you, Let's niggas, man. I hope you nigga ready. Now I'm coming. I'm full, nigga. Let me see. I want to make sure I didn't, I didn't uh, forget nothing. One thing I want to ask you. We're tech, you know, we talk about East Texas where the music is mm. concerned. We talk about Houston a little bit and Dallas. Yeah. But when you think about Texas on a whole, because Texas on a whole is not just Houston, Dallas, and East Texas. Yeah. You have other parts of Texas, but y'all never ever talk about all these people from other other parts of Texas. You have Austin, San Antonio. Oh, yeah. All these places don't have no rappers. Oh yeah, they do got rappers. Okay, why y'all never talk about them? I got them? a cousin that rap. Okay, but y'all never ever yeah, talk yeah, about from, these from, people. Y'all always talk about Houston, Dallas, hey, and East Texas. Nah, why? I'm gonna be. I'm gonna keep it real. You want me to keep Get it above? You want me to tell the truth? You want me to keep? You want me to keep it above? All the way on I'm gonna tell you now, man. Um, I gotta, I gotta hear your shit. Your shit gotta be loud enough for me to hear you, or you just ain't loud enough. Or, um, or they're you know not repping their city. No, nah, I ain't saying that. I'm saying I gotta hear your shit. If, if just I, I don't live in Austin. Austin got some rappers down there, but I mean, when I hear them, I'm gonna give them their props. But far as that, like, I'm, uh, if you paying me to, you know, what I'm saying to listen to it, I'm gonna check it out. Most definitely, I'm gonna keep it all the way above. You so if y'all want him to hear it, y'all got to pay him for it. No, it ain't that. <laughs> no, 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 don't said. get me wrong. That's don't get what me wrong. Just said. Don't get me wrong. Now I'm a listen. I'm a listen to what I'm listening to, regardless. Because anything out of these texts I'm listening to, but like, like I say, um, it's business. Ain't you say ball stop? Mm -hmm. It's business. You know what I'm saying. So where does Heavy Texas? Where does Texas music look compared to every other city? I think we uh we we still got we got a, we got a long way to go to get back to where we need to be. T I the reason we we like we is now anyway. T.I.Y. Yeah, because that shit was a little flip. That's a long time ago, though. Man, he fucked up the right. They fucked up the, the elevation of Texas at the time. Man. How can you say just 
I don't want to piss everybody off and take. We don't want to. We don't want to stir. Because if you stir up shit, they should whoop Ti motherfucking ass when he came to Dallas. I mean, they did. Yeah. No, they should have beat him up bad. Yeah, they should have beat him up bad. Yeah. That's huh? what. That's what slowed the whole Texas thing down, man. Right there, all that shit, man. Flip was on top. Yeah, but you got to understand, a lot of people wrote with Ti that was yeah, from exactly. Houston, man. Everybody from Texas should have been riding with Texas. That's just like in East Texas. I'm gonna ride with East Texas. You let a nigga from out of town, I don't give a damn phone. Fuck with this nigga from East Texas. You ain't finna come down here and do that. What Tupac say, we might fight amongst each other, but shit, when it come down to that, we together. Wow. I, so you, I, I Texas got to stand with Texas, though. No, That's I how you got to do it. Like, if, you, if a nigga from Texas, a nigga, I promise you, a nigga from Texas could not have did that to T.I. In, in Atlanta. I promise you he couldn't. Them niggas weren't finna go for that shit. Well, it was, it was some of your patriarch. I'll just say that because I don't want to piss nobody yeah, off. Yeah. It was some of your patriarchs just stepped up and, yeah. and 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 pretty much let that happen. Yeah, you seen them. We yeah. know who they were. We yeah. don't have to say their names, Damn but right. we definitely know who was who who let that happen. Who helped that to happen? Yeah, in Texas. So we just got to make sure that it don't happen again. Yeah. So you telling me after that incident happened, it Texas shit down. started going down like this, and yeah. it never came back up. No, nah, they got they got up a little high. Then PMC died. And that damn, that was even worse. Brain. It was like it was like damn. a chain of events. That's crazy, man. That spot that started off though. That so what can off. make us come up, come back up? Shit, we gotta stick together. Texas gotta stick together. That nigga said that. That's the truth. That's a whole. That nigga said that. That yeah. nigga there is a block. Texas in a whole. So when you hear people in Dallas or anywhere Bad Mountain, say East Texas, or East Texas say Bad Mountain, yeah. Bad Mountain, you know Dallas it's or East Houston or whatever. Of that. Well, you That's know, all ride, Texas, so I'm guess ride, what? Yeah, I'm a ride we need to stick Texas, together. But still say we, we need to stick together. together as Texas and not some be stuff be out of my <laughs> hand though. Some stuff be out of my hand. I ain't no. Nah, some stuff out of my hand. Wow, I, I I enjoy it, man. So so, how can people get a hold of you if they trying to reach out? Oh, Trill talk, no peel talk everywhere, man. Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, and TikTok too. Yeah, all that, everything. Yeah. Man, thank you so much for coming on the show, bro. Hey, man, I can't wait to get into it. Uh, we got a lot to do. Uh, sure. Say, man, check it, man. Hey, man, make sure y'all like and subscribe to Boss Talk 101, where the bosses talk. Um, it's going down, man. Holla at your boy. Man, it's been another great segment of Boss Talk 101, where the bosses talk. And we out.